Hi, I'm Doug Gorlay, broadcasting not live at all from, well, not VMworld where you'd expect me to be, but Barcelona at our Global Customer Advisory Board, where we bring our largest enterprise and service provider customers together to get insights into our roadmap and strategy and make sure we're building the right thing for them. Uh, however, the bulk of my team is at VMworld this week in amazingly Las Vegas. Um, I wonder why they made that decision. So anyway, what we're introducing at VMworld is several interesting technologies that bring the server and the network closer together than ever before, as we talked about back on June 24th, um, our launch at Cisco Networkers uh, slash Cisco Live in Florida this year. VNLink is the first technology we're introducing. VNLink connects a SAN, LAN, and unified fabric networks to the virtual machine, enabling vMotion and per virtual machine transparency. Services get applied to the virtual machine and then follow the virtual machine as the VM may move in a DRS type implementation throughout the network. The three interesting and key products and parts of this technology. For the LAN, we have the Nexus 1000V, where we've taken the NXOS operating system and embedded the NXOS operating system into a VMware hypervisor, enabling services like access control lists and counters on a per VM basis. As the VMs move, the Nexus 1000V coordinates that move throughout the network and ensures that all these services stay consistent. The server team sees what they're used to, and they see the policies that the network team has defined on a per port and VM profile basis and apply those to each virtual machine. On the unified fabric side, we've invented and pioneered a technology jointly with VMware that we're bringing to the standards bodies, for instance, the IEEE. This technology is called VN tag. VN tagging, just like the Nexus 1000V, although a hardware implementation, enables us to provide per virtual machine services through the hypervisor, through the I.O. interface, and to the network switching infrastructure. In the storage area network, we have features to track the movement of storage and the movement of virtual machines together. So that as a virtual machine moves, we can simply re-tag and re name and sort of NAT the worldwide name so that the move can happen on the vir of the virtual machine without having to have an associated storage movement every time. We've also introduced specific technologies for a WAN optimization product, Cisco WAS. WAS now enables the acceleration and deduplication of VDI streaming, virtual desktop infrastructure. This enables up to two to three times more users per branch and enables some of our customers to accelerate their deployments. Customers who are now deploying thousands of virtual desktops. And as I've seen this week in Barcelona, customers who have up to three to 5,000 virtual desktops running between locations like Bangalore, connecting back to New York City, and Moscow, connecting over to London specifically for reasons like data loss, data leakage protection, as well as a more uniform and consistent operating environment. We are also introducing secure 8 gigabit, 8 gigabit fiber channel. Not just 8 gig FC, but encrypting that fiber channel with AES-128 encryption, hop by hop, with no loss or degradation of network services, all done at wire rate. So this recaps some of the key announcements we've had this week at VMworld. And I look forward to talking to you guys soon. Thank you.